Welcome to this section of the World of Warships playthrough that I'm calling Why Do I Like a Particular Ship? In this case, why do I like the Pan Asian Class 1 cruiser Chen Yan? Now, well, it's very similar to the Orlana, the Soviet Orlana, in terms of that it has also two turrets, two guns each. In a way, it even looks similar to, to it in terms of a construction. There's, there are, of course, differences, but overall, that's what it is. Like the Soviet one, it is nothing much really to be said about its armor. It's slightly better in terms of uh, hit points, but armor-wise, it's again, it's paper thin. It's got similar battery, 127 millimeters, but its guns do make a bigger impact. I feel, at least that's how it looks to me. Like if you look at the maximum shell damage, it's uh, much higher than the Soviet one. The range, well, the modified range is at 8.5 kilometers. It's 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 uh, shorter than the Soviet one, and of course uh, the speed is 19 knots, which is uh, kind of slowish. But more or less, everybody in this class is going this type of speed. Is they're not really going that fast. So let's get right into it. Let's get right into the battle. So the the ship itself is not really much of a class. It's actually was it seems to be been a one-off maybe. It was built in Japan. It was a Japanese ship. But after World War II, it was handed over to Republic of China, which is in, you know, also known as Taiwan right now. And so it served in Taiwanese Navy for, for a while and then was scrapped like, well, most of the older ships do get scrapped eventually. Alright. As you can see, it also has death charges on the back, so it's supposed to act as a, as a type of anti-submarine uh, vehicle, but... Uh, a submarine ship, but of course we don't have any submarines in the world of warships. Now we're gonna go and see. Okay, so we're on this, this side. We got. Um, let's see who we got here. We got a Brit and a B and the German near near us. So we can go full speed. We're gonna stand next to the Brit and the German and. Uh, Generally, as with the Soviet one, you don't really want to be close to the enemies uh, since you don't have much in terms of armor or hit points. And as with the Soviet one, it has a pretty, pretty good turn ability. Speed of the turn is pretty nice, and we can take that to our advantage and let's sail behind them. Black Swan is actually a very beautiful right there. Well, there's one enemy there. German. That's fine, if you not really that one. And we can't really reach it with our guns. Eh? That German is falling behind, and it's a human player, that's why. Battle there is it goes out to full, but I don't see anybody here. There's somebody firing from that end, so there must be somebody there. Okay, so we have located on that side of the speak engine can try to shoot that guy but it's too far. That's just also too far. We lost one. That's not going that good for us. Alright, we're gonna take a bit of a wider thing, and uh, I think the German is drawing in. Now I'm gonna try to do this so I can get more. Oh my god, on this guy. There we go. See, nice damage. Look at that one. The amount of damage this thing dishes out. Slow 
slow down a bit so that we can uh, take our time aiming. More slow down. There we go, good. Able to deal with the damage. Okay, let's hear it. He's taking the damage here. There we go. Got the citadel. Speed up a bit. I think that's too far, but we're gonna give it a try. Kind of missing a bit on speed here. help contribute here. Come on, sink, sink, sink. There we go, good. got an enemy that way. Burn towards it. Alright. This is getting tricky because there's only three of ours left against four of them. Another German is there. Hopefully we can do some damage. Damn it, damn it, this one's worth close. Okay. All 
right, we, we even it this out. No, 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 we still got one more. Ah, so okay. Two hours left. No, there's an enemy database. You can see this is a pretty, oh, well, a, pre a, a pretty good shape it was, um, but uh, of course, when we were alone, uh, like I said, as I mentioned, there's not a lot of armor, but generally the amount of damage that you can't do is amazing. So, from that perspective, it's a, you know, you really, really can use the ship to do a lot of damage as long as you stay out of range of the enemy which is uh, or out of attention span of the enemy let the enemy focus on somebody else and you can uh, pretty much uh, pound away at uh, them and do uh, quite a lot of damage that's the reason i like the the, the pan asian plus one cruiser Chen Yan. thank you for watching and thank you for listening